just my passion. Okay. And I wanted to do it. I wanted to do it well. Okay. But the thing about it is when we started studying music, we didn't intend to become professional musicians. Okay. My father started teaching us classical music, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. We would see classical musicians play on PBS. Okay. I don't know if you've heard of these names, Vladimir Horowitz, Rubinstein, all these people, okay. European cats. But we could not relate to them. And we thought that that was out of our reach until we saw this black dude play on PBS, okay. a guy named Andre Watts. When we saw him, my brother and I was like, yo, this dude looks like us. Yeah. He could do it, that we could probably do that. Right. And that's what um, inspired us to become professional musicians. All right. You know, I mean, at least in the classical, sure, you sure, know, because sure. we, we didn't intend, all we, all we knew was church music. Okay. You know, and then we thought that all brothers, that's what we could do. I didn't think the classical thing was within our reach because I'd never seen anybody, you know, I mean, you got to think about how important it is for young black kids to have role models, oh, man. Yeah. Because we didn't see that, we didn't think it was attainable. Okay. It's like now a black kid could say, yo, I want to become president. Hey. He could do it. Yeah. He could do it. It doesn't matter whether, uh, yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. It doesn't matter whether you're white, you, you're Republican sure. or Democrat. Yeah. But you have an example now that shows you how far you could go. Okay. And that's why I feel that it's really important for young black kids to have black role models. Because when you see somebody who looks like you doing something at a, a very high level, then it shows you that it's possible for you to do it too. Okay. Uh, uh, we always wanted to be able to play for regular people, for lack of a better sure. word. Because sure. the classical musician, it's like, it's, it seems like it's reserved for an elite few who understands sure. music. Not everybody could relate to it. Yeah, it's kind of condescending. Yes, exactly. Yeah, yeah. You understand? So I'm like, yo, why don't we take tunes that people know? and make it, uh, or rearrange that was it. That a brilliant idea. You know, I mean, really. thank you. You know, we rearrange in a classical style, but incorporate jazz with it, because sure. we, we're brothers, you know? Right. So we, we've got to be able to, you know, show our own culture in sure. there, too. So, and that's how, and since we started doing that, that's when our career began really. to climb up the ladder. What I want to say to kids who are considering an, an alternative career is that follow your heart, know your craft. People will tell you that you can't do it because when you tell somebody you're going to study music, they don't take you serious. They're like, oh, you can't earn a living. Everybody wants to be a doctor. Everybody wants to be a lawyer. Well, they want you to be a lawyer and, and so forth. But if music is, is your passion or anything else that you want to do, that is your passion. If that's what you enjoy doing, then do it with all your might because at the end of the day, all that matters is that you're happy.